Teaching in prison might seem daunting and dangerous. But it's not? No. Well, <laughs> yes. Well, well, no more dangerous than, um, um, what did you do before? Kindergarten. Hmm. Here are a few ground rules for your first day. Number one, don't ever turn your back on them. <laughs> Number two, never tell them anything personal. Okay, well, maybe, maybe I'll just tell them I'm a former kindergarten teacher. I think one of you guys ate his kindergarten teacher. <laughs> Relax. It wasn't all of her. And most importantly... Number three? I always forget that one. It's important, but not that important, right? Otherwise, I'd remember. Right. Here's your panic button. Wait, what? I thought this was the interview. <laughs> well, I'm not a teacher. Just remember the three things I told you. No, 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 no! How did I get here? Yesterday, I was a kindergarten teacher in charge of juice boxes and nap time. The end. Yay! <laughs> Today, I watched a man beat another man with his own prosthetic leg. I have some bad news, Stanley. Enrollment's down and your class is getting the ax. Wait, what? Um, I'm so, so sorry. Whatever happens, I'm here for you. Thanks, Ash. There is a job out there for Stanley Birdie. I promise. Nope. Nothing. You're out of luck. My budget is a desolate wasteland of broken dreams. Like Cleveland, without LeBron. But teaching's all I know. <laughs> well, boo-hoo. Go cry to Congress. Maybe they'll take education as seriously as immigration or incarceration. Now you're all caught up. Right now! It's just like any school, only regular students aren't serving a 20 life for murdering the wife's gigolo, but hey, I mean, two plus two is still four, am I right? Our first day, Fish? Uh, yeah. You think I should stay? Why do you love teaching? I know it's not the paycheck. If it is, you're dumber than you look. So, how was your first day? Oh, yikes, that's not a good sign. I will never admit having said this. But you, Stanley, are a good person. And we need good people in there. I had a plan for my life. How do I move forward if I can't be me? Well, you're always you. You just gotta figure out who that really is. So that's how it starts. A former kindergarten teacher trying to connect with hardened criminals while testing the limits of his health insurance. One day at a time. Wish me luck. Time passes just like that. Now, you play your cards right, you can be me in 30 years. Roger! Ah!